Hey, hi, hello, welcome back to my new video. This is Sampath, you're watching Sampath Samfx YouTube channel. This is Xiaomi Mi 11X 5G other, Poco F3 5G other, Redmi K40 5G. Back with new video, guys. This is a C Android Fan Edition 10.4 Android version is 14 here, which is the latest one. And April 5, 2024 is the Android security patch. And vendor security patches June 1, 2023. Kernel user is 4.1.246. No kernel build date, you can see April 10th. Latest build available for Poco F3, the Mi 11X. This is the typical home screen what we can get, and these are the quick settings toggle. And in the edit section, there are few toggles like mic axis, location, and camera axis. And like I want dark theme to be in the main QS panel here. Dolby Atmos is also required for me. Again, I want to turn the FS information also. We'll add that too. I think it's there yeah sync option is also available these are the things what i'll do once you flash any of the custom rooms use the required qs panels okay done now we'll turn off the location not necessarily required every time and fps information for that this particular video i'm just enabling no need to enable every time again guys this is the typical home screen and if i press and hold here wallpaper and style again lock screen customizations are not given here you need to download it manually and home screen again change wallpapers there are few wallpapers pre-installed here this is a fan edition upgrade you get up to 6 into 10 and other things will remain same again widgets you will get that clock widget if you want you can drag add them here and you can shape them and size them if you press and hold again you, will, you can remove that that's how it is Coming to some app settings here, dialer, you get CR red dialer here, direct video call feature is available and call recording feature is also available. It will not announce the other person that you are recording the call. That kind of call, I mean dialer is available here. And regarding file manager, you get this kind of file manager, the me file manager. If you want my files, you can install that too. I mean the Google file manager. This is the very limited uh, apps are installed and camera, you get a proper nx camera here and video support 4k 30 is available no 60 and it's not a leica integrated guy. very simple camera let's see yeah it is leica integrated anyhow this is the camera if you want to use any gcam ports you can do that very similar uh, experience here see right here and i want to check some results i already taken them uh, images screenshots yeah We'll start with the Geekbench only. Can't open the file. Where we need to check those things recent here. Yeah. Can't open this file. Anyhow, we'll download the my files. Google my files. You can also check out real time experience here. Yeah, Google files by Google. Install this. It will be solved. And the home screen customizations and everything is remains same here. The UI is really, really smooth, guys. No problem regarding that. Uh, yeah, now this one has been downloaded. Let's allow that. Yeah, now I can able to see the images. Anyhow, this is the Geekbench score. What I got 930 is a single score and multi score is 2912. And the version of uh, and this one Geekbench is 6.2.2 and there are some 14 links 4.19.246. No kernel has been used. And this is version 10.2.4 than 2. And 6 lakhs 18,195 is the score what I got and temperature is was 2.2 degrees Celsius and 4 percentage of battery has been dropped during this testing in this particular device guys and this is a read write speed test with numericals now and this is basic integrity and CTS profile match getting both passed and play store is certified hence using payment applications is not a problem in this particular ROM and here DRM information HDR10 support and level 1 certified and watching audit application is also not a problem and this is my Airtel fiber connection up to 200 Mbps it's available it's showing 240 which is good in my opinion charging speed rapidly is available as you can see it will go around 22 watts only that's how it is 33 watt charging support is available here and this will the apps install and Dolby Atmos is properly given here and we'll show you settings here yeah these are the recent apps very much smooth the haptic feedback strength is also fine into the cr drive settings you get plenty of options again 
logo you can position them colored icons show notification count and again clock style status bar icons you can enable or disable quick settings customizations are also there battery style dual tone theme other things you can check out here you can actually customize these things uh, plenty are given regarding user interface again you get plenty notifications island notifications are also given here uh, make it less boring and blink flashlight for incoming calls you can customize them sound customizations are also given miscellaneous settings again unlock high fps in games like bgma you can enable that and unlimited photo storage and swipe to three finger screenshot is given this is the about shared right i will come back here this is the actual settings now into system again you get system profiles here and system update is also available but i recommend to flash through recording flashing method and firmware used are given in the description and if you still not join the whatsapp group for this particular device the mail on x i will recommend to join that the group link is given in the description check out the description don't forget it out guys and coming back here uh, navigation mode guest navigation you get both option to increase spill length and radius there is a ime space and navigation hint also you can enable or disable and back gesture height also you can customize from here left edge right edge sensitivity also you can adjust from here and if you come back again uh, passwords and account digital well-being those are going to work fine here safety and emergency are also given like location google maps everything is working fine just disable that if you don't want to use it every time accessibility menu is also given here which is a handy feature without actually using the physical buttons you can actually access the volume and other things check out once you flash the rom and security and privacy you get both face unlock and fingerprint unlock no app lock here let me check out the face unlock first as you can see it is quite fast and accurate even the face unlock as you can see it's fast and accurate to unlock your smartphone using both the face and fingerprint unlock which is really really good in my opinion and this is customization already explained regarding display settings again you get plenty of options here dark theme once i enable that you also get that pure black option which will be in the pitch black condition night light feature you can adjust the intensity colors there are some options plenty are given and tap to wake tap to sleep are given per app refresh rate and custom display settings are also given here once you enable that you will get into display settings again these are the things what you can expect from shared word fan edition sound settings again me sound enhancer is also given dolby atmos anyhow is pre-installed and you also get these options here hi-fi audio system is also given clear speaker is also given Di vibration pattern for ringtone is also given and vibration and haptics you can individually adjust the uh, intensity from here battery and battery life is really good here i was surprised using this particular rom the battery life is really really good once you start using that for a couple of days the battery life is going to improve a lot this is how the seattle fan edition guys everything is running fine i haven't faced any issues as of now if you have any specific questions regarding this particular rom comment down in the comment section we'll see the bgmi how it handles in this particular rom coming to graphic settings in the bgmi as i shown before you can get an option to increase the high fps here 90 fps option has been enabled hence extreme plus it is showing now actually it handles let's see and this is the volume panel what we can get here and this is the quick settings toggles and notification toggle here let's see there was a lag if you guys can notice or not but still i can able to kill them Yeah, there is an insert lag here, but maybe I haven't downloaded most of the files. Still, it's not a gaming ROM or anything like that, guys. Keep in mind, and it is completely unplayable at that moment. Might get improved, but again, game application updates also make sometimes the game worsen. There was huge lag actually while playing the games. And device is also getting a little bit of warm here. Yeah. yeah. We'll come back here. That's the gaming experience in this shared red uh, fan edition, guys. 
and uh, normal edition video is also coming evolution x other uh, hyper res based roms already videos are in my channel check out my channels there is a special i mean dedicated group for this particular days also playlist is available in my channel check out uh, me Linux playlist you'll get a lot more videos check out my videos and if you're still not subscribed to my youtube channel hit that subscribe button also guys and uh, if you want to like the video give it a like guys i'll be motivated to make similar kind of videos guys it will be a uh, lot more effort required to make the video guys kind of this videos and highest possible quality i am giving you out and i hoping just a likes and views for this particular video guys maximum is recommended thank you guys we'll meet you with another interesting video until that keep smiling bye bye for now